everyone, so today in this week's video I'm going to be doing a what to do when you're bored in fall video because I did a what to do when you're bored in summer video and I had so much fun making that video because it's so bright and colorful and it's like aesthetic AF. So, in this video I'm going to be showing you some possible things that you could be doing in the fall, especially when you want to take a break from homework and school because we all know it's important to take breaks in between your studying sessions. So I'm going to be showing you some DIYs, some treats, some makeup ideas, and some other knick-knack paddywhacks that you could possibly do in the fall season to make your fall Tumblr AF because who doesn't want a Tumblr fall? I mean, come on. So if you are new to my channel, then hello girl, how are you? Or boy, I don't judge. My pronouns are he, him, and his, and I have Netflix and pizza parties every week, so please be sure to click that subscribe button down below. And if you are watching this, you should be eating your pizza right now. I mean, I probably should have some to give to y'all, but maybe next week. But yeah, so without further ado, let's get into fall! Whoosh. So for the first fall activity that I am going to be showing you guys is to make some fall tumbler snacks and we all know that food is bae and bae is food. So these are just some apple slices that I spread peanut butter all over. You could totally use whatever you want like pumpkin butter, almond butter, but I also used Nutella because I was craving a sweet tooth, you feel me girl? And then we're just going to be sprinkling on some cinnamon to add to that fall aesthetic because we want to have a tumbler fall, you feel me? And they're so easy and so yummy to make and literally you can make this after school for a snack or anything like that. Like that or for a picnic which is going to be the next activity and the next thing is a fall picnic so if you have friends which I don't have any friends you could totally throw a fall picnic party in your backyard in the woods or anywhere in the park all you're gonna need are some fall blankets whether it's plaid red orange fuzzy anything like that anything to make it warm and cozy that is totally perfect for your picnic and I decided to use some fake leaves and just spread that all over my blanket to make it more fall AF and you could totally just eat some snacks and my favorite snack right now is the pumpkin pretzels which I got from Costco and they're so yummy you guys they're literally fall like they scream fall I'm like oh but yes they are so good and you should totally throw yourself a fall picnic party and the next idea is to have a hot cocoa contest so again if you have some friends or a sibling or anything like that you can try to compete to see who can make the best hot cocoa or like the prettiest one so you're just going to be making your hot cocoa and then I decided to put some caramel at the bottom literally you could do whatever you want whatever works for you and I'm going to be adding some marshmallows because who doesn't love marshmallows in their hot cocoa and if you've never tried whipped cream in your cocoa you need to try it girl because you're missing out and then I decided to drizzle on some caramel and it looks so beautiful and heavenly and then sprinkling on some cinnamon or nutmeg or anything like that and it's honestly so Instagram worthy so you just gotta try it and have fun and be creative with it so the next thing that you could do in the fall time is try out different makeup looks for the fall, especially with like fall makeup looks, especially with darker lip colors or darker eyeshadows. I personally love taupey and brown eyeshadows that are matte, and I just like putting that into my crease and outer V and just darkening it up a little bit to add some dimension to my eyeballs and eye sockets. So just make sure you blend all that. And you know me, I love me a good wing girl, but I don't wear that often. So in the fall time, I like to dress it up sometimes, and I usually use a dark lip color for the fall time and I've been loving this one by MAC. It's called Burgundy and here is an Instagram picture which I will be inserting to show you what it looks like and it's so beautiful you guys. I love me some lip liners because lip liners last so long and they're so smooth and the next color is called Whirl and Kylie Jenner actually uses this so it is like a mauve brownish pink color and I'm just gonna line my lips with this and fill it in and it lasts literally all day. It could withstand anything like your PSLs so you are good to go for the whole day and you're just gonna be looking on fleek for the fall time so yes. So the next activity is going to be DIY room decor and I recently just did DIY fall room decor so please be sure to go in the description down below and check that out if you haven't already. So what I'm going to be doing is printing out some pictures from Tumblr that are really beautiful and like fall themed and I printed them onto glossy paper because I wanted it to look more capiche, you feel me girl? And I cut them off and I kept the white edges because I want it to look like a Polaroid and you could totally clip this onto your photo string or I personally stacked it on like this and I think it looks so cute that way rather than like straight across. But yes, that is a simple DIY that you could totally do for your room. 
So the next thing that you can do is have a scary movie marathon, and you know me, girl, I love me some horror movies. I'm like a horror movie fanatic over here. So you could totally just binge watch all your favorite horror movies on like Netflix or anything. And if you're not into that whole like zombie ghost slasher genre, then you could totally watch like Halloween Town or Twitches or anything like that. But for me, I love watching some horror movies and watching the annoying characters trip over the dumbest things and get attacked by the killer because we all know that's not realistic so we can pretend we have a bay and like hide in our sweaters as well or our blankets because we single AF but I just want to give a quick shout out to mooncats.com they were nice enough to send me a sweater and they specialize in cashmere sweaters and they are so comfy so if you are looking for a sweater especially for the sweater weather season then definitely go in the description down below and check them out because we totally hooked you guys up with the discount code and everything so yeah totally check that out because sweater weather is in season all right everyone thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and if you did please be sure to give this video a big old thumb up you can only give one thumb here on youtube so please be sure to give that video a thumb up i have a weird thumb it sticks like straight up it's not like a hitchhiker thumb but give this video a thumb up leave a comment down below if you got inspired by this video or if you have any other fun ideas that you could possibly do in the fall because i probably just came up with like the most basic ideas but anyway so yeah i make videos every week so I will see y'all next week, but until next time, stay flawless, and I hope y'all have a blessed fall season. Bye!